Hi guys, welcome to the channel. I've just um, purchased myself a DJI Mic 2. So let's open it up and see what the difference is between this and the original one that I'm wearing on here. Okay, so in the box we get oh, a case and some instructions while I look at it. Quick start guide. Other crap, what's in here? Oh, there's some stick. Oh, we've got drain stickers in there. Never mind. Okay, it's just some other DJI stuff. Because DJI is a big um, producer of drains around the world, probably one of the biggest. And I've got a couple of these here, fantastic drains. Okay, so what's in the packet here? Okay, we get. A USB A to USB C cable. So this is here is a connection cable to connect up to cameras. And as I've done over here, I connect it up to my ATM Mini Pro, which is my sound. So you've got um, the new little dead cat things that allow you to um, reduce some wind noise. And I'll show you how that goes on because we've improved it a lot. You've got two of them. Got a silica pack, yeah, just some silicon. And in here you've got the mic. Okay, so in the old box, it just uh, flips open. Yeah. In the new box, you actually have to push this and then accidentally have it come open. Okay, so what have we got in here? You've got the two microphones, and they've got a clip arrangement, and they've also come with a magnet. So as you can see, I've magneted mine on, magnet on the inside. Now that's why the little fluffy cat fell off this one. Because, I'll show you in a minute. There you go, I'm without fluffy cat. Okay, now that just fell off because the ends, they get a bit worn on the, um, first one so these little bits get worn if they, they don't fit in properly after they get worn you can't buy new ones they're not expensive but these ones don't have that arrangement i have a little i don't know if you can see it there mm. i have a little hole that fits in up the top here so it just clips in place and it's not coming off and it's it's not something that's going to wear like the other one did, and it just pulls up, pulls off when you finish with it. What else have we got in here? We also have the receiver, and oh, two little connections. One is a lightning connection for your um, iPhones, and here's a C connection for your Samsung ones and other Android type arrangements. So to fit it on a phone. You take out the blank clip, you then slide in this, and then do the phone, grab the phone. So on the C connection of the phone or your lightning connection, it just pushes on, get in, and it sits down the bottom of your phone like that if you're filming with your phone. Cool. Uh, works really well. Right, get that off. Which way? I can't remember which way I put on there. Well, that way. That way, but I'll do the blank. So, the other good thing about these um, resistors, although these are um, transmitters, cool. Now, the new one has a little um, directional. I'll turn it on so you can have a look. Okay, English. Uh, skip the date, only 21st there, yeah, that's the right date. 2014, that's the right time too. Okay, so you have your um, touch screen. Oops. I'm gathering here, yeah, you can move it around like this and select with the selection thing on here, or you can just move with your finger if you want, but sometimes you accidentally push what you don't want to push. So, so you get um, a selection touch screen selecting thing on your receiver. A few other things, let's have a look what this mic does. 
Okay, so, uh, excuse my notes, it's got noise cancelling on it, so that's one of the reasons I got it. So, because I'm around here a lot and I've got lots of printers going, you hear a lot of background noise. So, this you can actually turn on noise reduction. So, it just cancels out all the background noise. Um, you've got 14 hours of internal recording if you add them together. Okay, if you add the box on it, you've got 18 hours. So, so there's six hours on each. Six hours on each, so 18 hours total battery. So this actually charges the receivers when it's in its spot, just like you, you, um, you've ever used um, bud earphones. So it actually charges while it's in the, in the cradle. Um, but the inter the, the, the um, you can ship it out to your receiver and your receiver can um, then transmit the sound straight onto what you're recording from or you can record directly onto the transmitters. Okay, so you can put a memory card in there and record straight onto the transmitters and you can do 14 hours on directly onto the transmitters. Um, it has a 32-bit float as well, internal float which means um, sometimes when I'm talking my voice goes up and down and sometimes you can barely hear me and sometimes it sounds like I'm shouting um, but this internal float gets rid of it so it um, digitally alters the sound coming into it and levels it out a fair bit so it's a lot nicer to hear um, when people are speaking um, the range of it so the range the transmitter can be away from the receiver is 250 metres, which is 820 feet away. So um, I'm not sure who's going to be recording video and be that far away from their transmitter, but it works really well because I've um, walked down, down the hallway and it can still pick me up. It's really good. Each one of these little receivers has 8 gig of internal memory on it. So you, even if you don't want to do it to a memory card, it can record directly to the memory inside here if you don't want to put a card in there. It records 48 kilohertz, 24-bit audio. So the other thing you can do is if you have a phone, you can connect these transmitters directly up um, your smartphone. Or what's even better is if you grab one of these, which I'm going to do a video on. So I've also got one of these Pocket 3 cameras. It will connect directly to one of these using Bluetooth. So you can record straight all the sound onto it as well. You can get a um, lavalier mic that you can put on these if you don't want to just clip this to your hip and then have the mic coming up and just a little mic sitting on your on your shirt, um, which is, is a nice option to be able to have as well. Now the difference between number the number two and the number one which is this one. I don't have it all in one place when I'm using it at the moment. So, as you can see, the um, little bit bigger. It's the same height, but it's a bit wider. Okay, but believe it or not, this is lighter than this. And this has a bigger battery charge than this. So this one, the Mic um, 2 has 18 hours. You can get 18 hours total if you use one receiver at a time. And this one can get 15 in the mic one. So the mic two has Bluetooth, the mic one doesn't. The um, LED screen on the front is a 1.1 inch screen on this and on this one up here. Here it's a 1.1 inch. So the screen is a little bit larger, yeah? Okay, so this has got, like I said, the internal float, which um, levels out your voice and stuff. So this one doesn't. And this one has noise cancelling, which the original one doesn't as well. So um, it made a quite a few improvements on the old, on the old mic. And it comes in, if you buy it as a kit, it comes in a nice little case. You can buy several things separately. You can buy just the, the transmitter. If you want to do the transmitter, don't forget you can record directly onto it. So you don't need all this other stuff if you don't want it. Makes it a lot easier if you've got all this other stuff. But you can buy this separately. You can buy just the receiver and transmitter separately like that comes in a little bundle or you can buy the whole kit so um prices vary depending on where you are so this cost 
me about five hundred dollars. Now the good thing about um, I went to DG a DJ, I think it's one it's called, which is one of the DGI resellers, and they price matched. So they will price match if um, if you have a price and you can show them that you have a price that's cheaper, they'll price match it for you. So um, hopefully I'll get a lot better audio out of this for my videos. And there you go. That's a nice little kit. So guys, if you're looking to buy a microphone, um, these are excellent quality. DGI make some really good stuff. Um, they make the drains they make are like top-notch drains as well. So you've got this, you've got the little cameras, which are, this one I've got too. So I've got quite a few of these little cameras. Um, I've got the old version, I've got the new version. So I'll go I'll be able to do a video of what's the difference between those two as well. Okay guys, just a quick one. So I hope that helped if you're thinking of buying a mic. Um, there's quite a few differences in the old and the new one. And yeah, there you go. Okay, see ya, bye. Okay guys, thanks for watching. I really do appreciate the support. You might like one of these, or one of these videos um, that I've made in the past, so feel free. Okay, thanks guys, bye.